bring on good, you know. So you play in multiple spots, you play in wide receiver and age, kind of like you did last year. Just talk about kind of the roles you're playing, KJ. Uh, I'm playing the same roles I had last year, you know, with the H and the uh, outside. But like, mainly at the H though, me and Paris is, uh, we just rotate one or two. Coach Meyer's been talking you up and some of your other coaches. What do you think you're doing to kind of catch their eye this spring and press them this spring? Probably just balling out, you know, got the confidence back. It's my uh, third year here now, so it's like, I'm a veteran now, so it's just like, it's time to go now. When you entered the spring, like you said, it's your third year here, and Curtis is gone, Noah's gone, you guys kind of need some production at wide receiver. What did you kind of have expected for yourself to get out of spring? Uh, I expected to be be the leader, uh, uh, you know, be one of the leaders in the room, start uh, talking more, being more vocal, and uh, getting guys going, you know, bringing younger guys up. And uh, for myself, you know, establishing myself as a playmaker. We've heard Urban talk about uh, Paris a lot. He said he's kind of like the number one guy. No, nope, sorry to tell you that, but uh, at, just in your room, and he said obviously you too, but what has Paris really shown, I guess, this spring? I know he's playing a lot of H with you. Mm -hmm. Does he seem kind of like a natural fit there in the slot? Yeah, he do. You know, uh, he, he used to be a running back right. in high school, so, you know, it's a natural fit for him. And, you know, I think he knows, like, it's like he's a senior now, so it's like mm -hmm. more like it's either go home or go to the league or what, what you're trying to do. Like, it's right. time to go. So that's mainly his head, I know, because we talk, you know, so that's mainly what he thinks about. KJ, what about uh, Johnny Dixon? Um, I think that he's been injured his entire career, basically. And Johnny, Johnny looking okay? nice right now. You know, he, he's fully healthy. He in a tri uh, getting treatment every day, um, but he's looking faster, you know, um, but his body is really healthy and holding him up right now, so I expect him to have a big year this year. I know you haven't had a lot of install at this point, but what kind of no uh, changes have you seen under uh, Kevin Wilson and Ryan Day with the offense? Swagger. I say that because, uh, you know, because Wilson got something to him, because they got something to him, so, you know, we coming behind them, leading us up on the offense. We like that, so, um, and also the deep ball, you know, we got to, our percentages are going up every practice, you know, so we had a drought, but uh, I think it's going up, so I think those two things. Yeah. Up-tempo as well, you guys going a lot up-tempo oh, this yeah, spring? definitely faster. One of the knocks on the receivers has been the lack of separation. When you hear that, what do you, A, what do you think, and B, how do you get it? Is it more than just speed? Is it improved route yeah, running? You got to think, you know, sometimes the corner going to sit on you, and if you got a route coming back to the ball, you really can't do nothing. So a lot of teams play us like that because of the deep ball situation. But I think like right now we're getting a lot of separation because our corners don't know what are we doing really, you know. So I think that's going up. KG, uh, Paris Campbell was saying uh, over there that uh, you guys as a group knew <laughs> yet last year wasn't the year you wanted to have, right? I mean, and I don't know, what have those meetings been like between just among you guys and stuff just about – kind of getting back on the beam, so to speak? Uh, you know, everybody got the same motto this year, you know. It's been different types of things going on, but like right now we just want to establish ourselves as the best group in the country. So we just practicing like that every day. Even though it's getting tough, we just still remind each other about it, and we want to be the, uh, <laughs> be the best. Why, can, can, why you, is can you tell everybody out there is a year older now? I mean, sometimes it takes a while for a group to gel, doesn't it? Yeah, it do, but like we've been here I've been here three years, Paris four years, uh, Terry and all them, same class. So, um, yeah. We've been gelling for a minute now, so you know we always hung out together. Then we got Ben and Austin came in. Austin came in early, so he was already with us. Now Ben with us now, so it's just like a, a good gel. You know, we hang out every day after class. We got a group message, what y'all doing? So we, you know, we all. We yeah. Know, what KJ, what do you what do you think um, after last year? If last year wasn't the year you guys wanted to have, what do you think was the biggest issue with the way things went, and what do you need to repair the most for this year? Uh, I think we got all the issues out of the way, you know, but uh, like. We got new people that came in that are um, showing us the way for real or how we're gonna do things. And like, with, with last year it was like kind of a, like a drought, you know. Every, nobody was doing nothing. It was the, like it was predictable what we was gonna do. But like now, it's like totally different, you know. Everybody has swag on the offense. We going fast. We talking, talking to the defense, talking head to them. So like, I feel like we got something. With our, when going you say that all the issues are fixed, what can you be specific about what some of those issues might have been? Like, like everybody say, we we read media, so like everybody talk about our deep ball situation, so stuff like that. Uh, in, you talk about you, you talk about the basically some of the new wrinkles, et cetera, that Kevin Wilson, Ryan Day have brought. Yeah, it, definitely. It, give give me an example, of a couple of things. Uh, you know, we're not giving away, I guess, key, got, secret plays. But well, nah, not secret plays, but like just like, like I said, swagger, and then bringing the uh, 
they drilling us on the deep ball. You know, we got we got a percentage charge we want, uh, look at every day to see how we're doing, yeah. and that's been going up. And so just the way that Coach Day is teaching the quarterbacks and just giving us do whatever you want but be at that spot, that's helping us a lot. How have you seen the JT? threats on this team that you've seen? Throughout uh, spring, I know Terry, uh, Paris, uh, me in the slot, uh, Johnny, Ben, Austin, you know, like, we really, everybody really. So hey, everybody's percentage is going up. You're doing punt return turn, right? Yeah. How's that going? Oh, it's going good, you know. I did it a little last year too, so. Yeah. Just naturally. Here. What have you seen JT kind of, you know, operate, I guess, this spring with the new coordinator, new coach, and then throwing deep? I mean, a lot of people were kind of on him. Yeah, they as on well. him, but like, with how. Coach Day is coaching him. He's doing terrific. You know, we love it with how he's throwing it. We just got to make the play. Have you seen more production?